Hmm. Maybe not all the distortion. Hello everyone, this is Kimmy Wyatt and welcome to this video. Uh, today I am in my kitchen. This is about my gang stalking, but uh, please subscribe to the YouTube channel and be sure to click that notification bell so that you will be one of the first to get notifications of new vids I post up. Also scroll down where the text is posted for the video. You will find some terms, T-E-R-M-S. I ask that you look those terms up via a video format platform, and right now that's YouTube. Also scroll down where the text is posted for the video. You will find my um, skin and hair care line, uh, product listing, as well as ordering information. Please order some things, you guys. Excellent, excellent. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. So uh, um, any questions or whatever, just call the number that's there or send me a letter. The address is there. So I'm in my kitchen, you guys, and I'm glad this is happening again. Before the sun went down, uh, I noticed this, you guys. I'm an electrical fool, electricity. Uh, as mentioned in other videos, I took electrical courses. I know about near field and all that stuff. And I want you guys to look at the very top of the video where you see all that distortion. You see that distortion? It's like crackly like that's an indication that there is something electrical. This should be their kitchen as well, right above my head, okay? And it is. Notice, I want you to watch. Because I can hear 85% of them saying they know everything I'm doing in my kitchen. If I get some water, she's getting some water. If, I, if I'm about to make some tea, she's make, make, about to make some tea. Please know that this is interference with... And notice it stopped. Okay. It stopped. Now check this out. Earlier today, when I did it, let me tell you what was happening earlier. Starting about, well, let me give you a little indication. Okay, there's the mic. Those are my cabinets. And that's the top of my venta hood. Okay, just to give you... Starting about right in the, you know, not too much until you get to the corner, not a lot of space. Starting, there it is again. Starting about right, let's see, where am I trying to go? Right there. Nothing. Keep looking at the very top. Look at the ceiling, in other words. Wall, ceiling, okay? And then as I go this way, and it's probably not going to do it. There, there you go. Look, look at the screen. Look at my ceiling. How it looks like one of those old TVs from back in the day when the TV would go off at twelve midnight. Okay. Notice it's still there. It's still there. Still, you can't probably can't see it now because of the wall. This is the wall at the top of my back door. I have two doors. Still there. And then when I get about right here, it stops. Why is it doing it here? And not doing it here. Also, I just noticed this and I didn't notice it earlier. It's doing it here. It's doing it all the way over here. I know what it is. All the way over here. Here comes my stove. Well, it stops. Well, it is still doing it. Nothing. Nothing. Once again, let me show you. <laughs> it's not going to do it. There it is. It, 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 it looked, I was still and it came back on. You guys, let me tell you what's going on. These are cameras. High-tech equipment that is interfering with the high tech the high techness of my cell phone camera i've even told you guys all you got to do if you want to know if you have um something in your um uh, recording devices or what audio devices in your place all you got to do is get an old school radio there's one right there mm -hmm. get an old school radio you know just just nothing spectacular and turn it on a station where there's 
you know, it's kind of, it's not clear if there's any station there at all, but make sure you hear the noise. Okay. And there is a station where it is purpose. I don't know what its purpose is, but it is purposely just playing that noise, I guess, for people to go to sleep. Now that I think about it, I don't know, but you can take that radio Put an extension card on it as far as much extension card as you need. And you can literally pan your, look at that, look at that, your place and find out where there's interference, where there's cameras. This is amazing. Not only that, I'm going to take you back over here. See how it's gone? And there it is. See how it's gone? There it is again. Gone. There it is. I can pinpoint every camera. This is why in this area, hold on, I'm going to hold on. They're able to see me down there and comment on every freaking, I'm going to say it, every fucking thing I do. Come back up. I didn't want the light to get to you guys. I'm on my ladder. Here's my ceiling. Male and fem females. The females up there and her little sister and her big sister is like, seems seemingly there's three in the family. And the middle one lives here with this ignorant ass guy, which is a punk. And then you hear two other voices, a younger voice and an older voice. I guess it's the younger sister and older sister who seems to both live in this complex as well because they can visit. They visit too damn frequent, frequently. I mean, like staying up all night, you know, blah, 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 blah. I mean, you know, just coming in. And, and, and not only that, uh, I followed her sister to, if that is her sister, the younger one so far, to um, an apartment. And I, I turned around because I left my door unlocked and she was going home. I heard her say, well, I'm going home. And she was going home and she was going to another apartment. But the funny thing is, there's no more static. Except for here. Look. Static. No static. Interference or static. No static. You guys, cell phones have come a long way. Um, when I, this first started with me, I downloaded apps, thinking that they really could check to see if you know you you know what was going on, if there was there was any um, uh, disturbance. And I'm not using the right term right now. And and several, you know, it seems like they did something, but not really. Look, but time has passed since that. Then that was to like 2018. Technology only gets better. As you can see, you guys, and I have, I've been working today with, with, so excuse my fingers if they seem dry or whatever, but I've been working on, on my uh, apartment and doing things. You guys, look, I'm going to show you. Hold on, hold on. Oh, it's gone. Let me find it again. Oh, okay. here we go. There's some, hold on. They're moving it. They're moving it. Look, I'm not moving. I'm not stopping it. They are. Look, that's not me. Because I'm interfering with it, with my, your, your body, your, you know, your body um, carries electricity. I'm interfering with it. When I do this, there's interference. Now, to prove my point, I'm going to go to a spot. There you go. Because there's nothing there. So you don't see the fruit, the end. You don't see the, this but when my finger comes up, that's probably why people's hair grows because people tell me I have, I have something going on with my body, my fingers. I have healing hands. And I believe that because I can grow your hair. You hear me? Um, yeah. It's God. And it's been in the same spot. Now there's nothing there because they moved it. You didn't see me do this. You didn't see me. There, okay. Yeah, this is them. They're doing, they're moving it. And it, and the reason why I just did it, though, that couple, it's the little second, is because there's cameras all over my apartment. Now, let me tell you guys something. 
There's three different types of cameras that these ignorant the a dollar sign dollar sign use. There it is again. They use regular camera cameras. These are for people who have absolutely no clue they're being spied on. Pinhole cameras, little pinholes, and and what I want you guys to do to see if you, if you want if you want to know rather if you have um recording devices, listening devices, um um you know anything electrical. It's called electronic stalking cameras in your place. Your place normally has a bathroom or restroom. I need you to go get some joint compound, J-O-I-N-T. You don't have to get the biggest one because all you're going to do is buy it, bring it home. I want you to make sure you have tennis shoes on because you need to get on top of your bathtub. You know, you just, just step up there, make sure it's not wet so you don't slip. Okay, if, if something happens to you, don't blame me. But I need you to step up there. Make If you're sh too short, make sure you have a ladder. You know, anything or you can step on the very top of your bathtub and stretch as far as you can. If you can't do this and you're too short, please have someone else do it. Okay. You see how it's coming in and out? Because I'm moving. There it is. Gone. There. And I mean, it's a lot of them, you guys. And these cameras usually are in, in, in um, sixes on a string. So there's six to a string. You know, some things you would get, something you would get from China that hardly no one has. You're a surveillance camera, basically. Okay, so the types of cameras that these ignorant asses use is just a regular camera. This is for um, all victims, but it's also for anyone who does not know they're being spied on. What's the use of us putting night vision cameras in her place when she doesn't even know she's being spied on. So every time she goes to the bathroom, she has a light on. So there's no need to put night vision cameras in her. And this her is anyone besides myself <laughs> or, or anyone else who, who knows they're being spied on and, or, and, or anyone else who knows there's being, they're being spied on. And they know what type of cameras these ignorant, ignorant, a dollar sign, dollar sign, at, uh, whatever are using. So you got your regular pinhole cameras. Okay. This would not be a pinhole camera because you would see a little pinhole and pinhole simply means the, the ink, like as an in ink pen. Okay. Camera, the tip of an ink pen that's small. And I have heard they've gotten even smaller. True. And I'm going to get back to what I want you to do in your, in your, your bathtub. Okay. The second type of camera that's used is a night vision camera. I have the, the, the first one and the second one in my apartment because they know I will go to the restroom and turn my light off in my restroom to use the restroom. And I'm going to tell you guys something, some other things that I have to do. I have something called a coochie cover. Now, I, I covered this, um, <laughs> pun intended, in a video from my last apartment where I have these makeshift or I make um, aluminum foil, um, devices, you know, that will cover my, my vagina area, kind of like a cup that a football player would, would use when playing football. You know, they have to put that to protect their private areas uh, with the cup. Only difference is mine is, would be more for a female, which would be kind of like a V shape and it would come up to the bikini line and, and well, they come up to the bikini line and, um, thicker way thicker because they're, they're aluminum and the reason for the aluminum is because aluminum is the only thing that repels these types of cameras okay let me find one mm, interesting where did you go the ones you just there you go yeah Aluminum foil and glass. Now, who's going to go around with glass? And I don't even know how that would be possible. But supposedly, doing all the research that I've done over the years, glass and aluminum are the only two items that repel. Look, these two. The these this type of camera. And what kind of type of camera is that, Kimmy? That's the third type, the kind that can see through walls, <laughs> see through. Uh, almost any freaking thing, any type of material, you would be surprised. Aluminum, and I'm talking about when I say it's contradictory, Kimmy. No, 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 no. There's different milli milliliters, millimeters of aluminum. 
okay, uh, thicknesses. I may be saying it wrong because I'm trying to hurry this up. So mylar, like the balloons, the mylar balloons, the ones that may have Mickey Mouse on it and on one side. And, and, and either way, if you have a two-sided balloon, you'll have pictures on both sides of Mickey Mouse. Or if you can get a one-sided balloon at the party warehouse or place or something and they blow them up. And, and those are mylar balloons. That's aluminum as well. Okay. Mylar is also the... Um, the things you put in your windshield, the windshield protectors, the sun protectors um, that you put in your windshield when you leave your car in the parking lot or something or at, at your home. You don't want the sun to get in there. If, if you have the kind that's real shiny, that's mylar, the same as the balloon. Very, very thin aluminum, but it gets even thicker and thicker. So they can see through that. You have to literally get aluminum, you know, foil, foil, foil. I, I mean, I, I, the foil industry, I, I should have stock. Oh, the aluminum industry. I should have stock in the aluminum industry. And one day I'm going to show you this big pile of, of whatever that I have to pow. I wish I had it in her before I started. I don't have a pause on this camera. I would, or I would go get it. But I wish I had, um, just to just show you the stuff I have to pile on my on, on the top of my body to go to sleep. There are videos already there in the Blue Cup in the Attic playlist. Please check the playlist out. But yeah, there's camera, there's there's interference here. This is why they they want to hear every freaking thing I'm saying. You see it right here at the top. And see my finger, my finger is not even interrupting this. So this is. This is powerful. This is right above my stove. Oh my God. This is where I make things. My stove. Where I make products and stuff in most cases. But before I go into the, the into my ceiling, I want you guys to know, uh, as I said, go to the store. Uh, a major, major brand of stores. Major, major. Has this joint compound in two sizes. And there's other brands as well, but they have a particular just generic brand in two sizes. And then the smaller size in Texas, just to give an example, is less than four dollars. You're not going to use all of it. It's pretty big. It's too big for what you're what I'm about to tell you to do. So in the meantime, put your tennis shoes on or some skid free shoes that you wear. If you work in the hospital, those will be fine. And get up on top of your bathtub, the very top where you can relax and put your arms up there, that part. OK, I want you to stand up there and I want you to put your finger. You don't have to get gloves because joint compound will literally rinse off of your fingers with, with, with soap and water. Really just water, but soap and water you should use. And I want you to put your finger in there and I want you to have it prepared to find pin holes in your shower. And just bloop, just do this. I had some up here and then I can't, I will show you. You're just going to do this. You're going to dip. You, should, you probably have enough on your hand to do it. What's going to occur in most cases, it's like when I first moved here in this apartment, you're going to hear doors slamming. You're going to hear people getting pissed off because they thought you were not woke. You did not know you were being spied on. Oh my God. Now you do. I also want to warn you, once you figure out what's going on, you guys, you're going to be followed. Ladies, because the whole goal for watching most of the women is to kidnap them. Set the new sex trafficking. The new slavery. And I say the new slavery because it is most. Well, I'm not going to say most. A lot, 12, over 12%, rather, let me put it this way, over 12% of Black African, of the Black African female gender, and I say gender because the young little girls are also kidnapped, tw kidnapped, 12% of the Black African female gender has been kidnapped in the U.S. alone, different age ranges. Mm -hmm. That little test right there will let you know that you are being spied on because you're covering the camera up. <gasps> no. 
Mm -hmm. And I was about to say something else. I told you the three types of cameras. So, so you got the regular camera. These are for, like I said, once again, let's recap people that don't know they're being spied on. Once it's escalated and they can tell that you are turning your lights off, you're scratching your head, you're on surveillance. There's, they see you. They see that you're wondering what's going on. Then you're going to go to the second type of camera, inclusive of the first. And that's going to be night vision cameras. So when you leave again, something is going to occur in the apartment above your head, below your head. However they have to do it, they're going to do it. They're going to use a bump key in most cases. One of those terms I've asked you guys to look up. Um, and those terms are once again, or it's at the very bottom of the text for the video. Um, a bump key, B-U-M-P-K-E-Y. They're going to use a bump key to come to your place. They don't need your key. What? They don't need that to come in your place. They use a bump key. This is why women have told me they, they have had their panties stretched across their bed, but their door was locked. Now you go to management and tell, well, you had to give the key to somebody. You Something happened. You know, they don't get it in most cases, in mostly all cases. But yeah, look at this. I'm standing up here and they're right there looking. Now, normally they would be talking. Oh, she fixed she to drink some tea. She fixing to make some tea. If they, if they see me pull a particular boiler out, I pull it out now just to trick them and put it back under my cabinet. If they see me pull a boiler out, one of those idiots are going to say what I'm fixing to do. Now, you notice I'm still here in this area. You saw the interference and it just magically disappeared. There it is again. And I didn't even have my hand here. I, I just did that just now. Just replay the video. But I want to show you guys what I found up in here in, in, in my um up here, you guys. When I, I can't let me see. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If I, I don't know if I can show it to you. I may have to do a part two. Or do I have a flashlight? I what I messed up this camera. You can't edit it. You can't well maybe hold on. Can I? Nah, the flashlight is disabled. Um, but there, yeah, you wouldn't be able to see up in in there. You can't see up in there. Yeah, there's some, there is it's, it's some stuff going on. I probably have to do a part two. Mm hmm. And it's something back here. I don't know what this is. Um, going back, back in that direction, up up here. I could have sworn I had my flash on, so but I don't I don't know how much. Yeah, I got plenty of time on her, so the flash wouldn't have gone out. Uh, I'm trying to see what I can do. I think I have a flashlight. Hold on, you guys. I'm just gonna keep that there. Okay, got it. Hold on, let me get this out of the way. Just a minute. Hold on, you guys. Just a minute. Okay, come around the front.
Okay, I have to answer the door. Just one moment. Okay. There is the cameras in the way. You can't see it with this direct light shining on it. But that piece of whatever that is over there, right there. Has a piece of metal on it. This is not, you need the, I need the camera. I need the light from the camera. You might can see it, that little dark piece that's there. Hold on. I don't know how I can do this, but. Yeah. Hold on. I can't. There's the I can't show you guys like I want to show it to you. Just one moment. Okay. Well, I'm going to go to go this way. Turn around. And it's probably going to be the same situation. Okay, you guys see that long something right there? 